Playing with Legos can keep any kid busy, but what do you get when you take a bucket of Legos, a child's imagination, and throw in a bit of robotics? Melissa Anderson takes us to Edward A. White Elementary School here on Post, where a group of students are taking Lego building to a whole new level. There's a group of mechanically minded students at E.A. White Elementary School. They're known as the Roaring Lions Brainiacs, and they're learning all about robots and life. You program them, you use math, and you use science. And I think that through doing this, we'll have life experiences. You learn how to face challenges that people might not face if they're not involved in this program. Students build the robots, design its attachments, and program its movements. And this takes more than just a slight interest in machines. You have to have the passion and the love, so you, and don't get frustrated with your robot, because your robot, it's doing what you tell it to do. You're making the decisions for it. If the robot doesn't work, you have to go back to the computer and tweak it, and nothing's always 100%. Sometimes it'll work, sometimes it's a little iffy, and sometimes it just flat out won't work. Every year, these talented youngsters compete in first LEGO League tournaments. This year's focus is improving the quality of life for senior citizens and not solely through robots. We decided to make a website that was senior friendly and that seniors would feel more comfortable using the computer maybe with this website and maybe it would help them. And so we actually made this website. It's called SeniorsRockinMindBodyAndSoul.com. There are three categories on that website, mind, body, and soul, and that's actually our school motto this year. Students achieve excellence in mind, body, and soul. By working on so many different things, these gifted students are learning a lot about teamwork. You have to work together as a team because if you don't, there'll be issues and you just can't really get anything done when you're not cooperating with each other. You need to keep control of yourself and you need to work together. They've even found a way to cheer each other on with a robotic rendition of the Army song. I'm fighting till today is one, and the lion is the roaring along. By focusing on how to work as a team and use their skills to help others, the robotics program isn't just building with Legos. They're creating building blocks that will help them in the future. Melissa Anderson, Fort Benning TV.